எலக்ட்ரானிக்ஸ் ஹிண்ட்ஸ் ஹாட்டிலி வெல்கம் யூ டு நோ த கம்பாரிசன்ஸ் பிட்வீன் ஏஎம் அண்ட் எஃப்எம் தேங்க்ஸ் ஃபார் வாட்சிங் த வீடியோ திஸ் வீடியோ எக்ஸ்பிளைன்ஸ் டிஃப்ரென்சஸ் பிட்வீன் ஏஎம் அண்ட் எஃப்எம் இன் ஏ சிம்பிள் அண்ட் ஈஸி மேனர் யூ வில் கெட் த நாலேஜ் ஆஃப் ஏஎம் அண்ட் எஃப்எம் ஃப்ரம் திஸ் வீடியோ ப்ளீஸ் லைக் ஷேர் த வீடியோ அண்ட் சப்ஸ்கிரைப் டு திஸ் சேனல் அண்ட் ப்ரெஸ் த பில் பட்டன் kindly view my coming videos you will receive more electronics information from my videos thank you differences between amplitude modulation frequency modulation the frequency and phase of the amplitude modulation are constant the amplitude and phase of the frequency modulation are constant the modulation depth of the amplitude modulation governs the transmitted power the frequency modulation is independent of the modulation depth the amplitude modulation uses the high level modulation the frequency modulation uses the low level modulation all the transmitted power of the amplitude modulation is not useful all the transmitted power of the frequency modulation is useful the amplitude modulation is less immune to noise the frequency modulation is high immune to noise the s bar n ratio of the amplitude modulation is low the s bar n ratio of the frequency modulation is high the amplitude modulation has small bandwidth the frequency modulation has large bandwidth the amplitude modulation does not have feature to reduce the noise by increasing the deviation the frequency modulation has feature to reduce the noise by increasing the deviation the amplitude modulation operate in mf and hf ranges the frequency modulation operates in the vhf and uhf ranges the amplitude modulation has high adjacent channel interference the frequency modulation has less adjacent channel interference the amplitude has lesser channels the frequency modulation has more channels The area of the reception of amplitude modulation is wider. The area of the reception of the frequency modulation is smaller. The amplitude modulation has lower sound quality. The frequency modulation has higher sound quality. The amplitude modulation requires smaller bandwidth. The frequency modulation requires higher bandwidth. The amplitude modulation transmitter is simple. The frequency modulation transmitter is complex. The amplitude modulation has only two sidebands. The frequency modulation has numbers of sidebands. The modulating index of the amplitude modulation varies from 0 to 1. The modulating index of the frequency modulation is more than 1. The signal of the amplitude modulation is low quality. the signal of frequency modulation is high quality the amplitude modulation is long range transmission the frequency modulation is short range transmission the amplitude modulation is more susceptible to noise the frequency modulation is less susceptible to noise the amplitude modulation is more prone to signal distortion and degradation the frequency modulation is less prone to signal distortion and degradation modulation index of the amplitude modulation is ma equal to kem divided by ec modulation index of the frequency modulation is mf equal to del f by fm the frequency range for am radio is 535 to 1705 kilohertz or up to 1200 bits per second or possible fm radio operates at a greater frequency range of 88 to 108 megahertz or 1200 to 2400 bits per second the circuit of the amplitude modulation is simple the circuit of the frequency modulation is complex the power consumption of amplitude modulation is high the power consumption of frequency modulation is very low the amplitude modulation requires low cost the frequency modulation requires more cost 
the amplitude modulation used for long distance radio amateur radio and some weather broadcasts the frequency modulation is used for high fidelity radio broadcasting television audio and some satellite communications waveforms of am and fm are given below thanks to google books and chat gpt